A bill that seeks to establish the Northwest Development Commission has killed second reading at the Senate. The bill, sponsored by Deputy Senate President Barack Jabrin, is one of the three bills read for the second time at today's plenary of the Senate, presided over by the President Gatswil Akmabio. The bill was introduced to the ninth Senate in 2019 but was not assented to. Now, with the reintroduction of the NWDC Establishment Bill 2024, it appears every region wants a commission. Leading the debate, Senator Jabrin noted that the commission seeks to act as a catalyst to develop the arrays of potentials of the Northwest, as well as address the gap in infrastructural development of the region. The bill seeks to provide for the establishment of Northwest Development Commission to act as a catalyst to develop the areas of potentials of the Northwest as well as address the gap in infrastructural development of the region. The Northwest Jupuku Zone as a region has contributed immensely to the overall development of Nigeria in terms of agriculture and other areas of endeavor. Yet, the region remains hugely underdeveloped. What the region requires now from the federal government is the support to develop its infrastructure and educate its, 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 its team in use so as to drive the process of developing the zone in its entirety in order to grow at par with more developed zones in the country. Lawmakers who supported the bill include Godswill Akpabio, Adamo Aliero and Ava Morrow. The Northwest is uh, very large. The youthful population very uh, much. The need for development very clear, and uh, uh, insecurity will be minimised if more development enters there, and educational facilities are made more available. So, for for us, development anywhere in this country is development everywhere. So I'm not lobbying you to accept. I will see put the question. But my opinion is that I'm a lover of development. A lot of uh, devastation, a lot of destruction due to the activities of Boko Haram and also the bandits. The Northwest had the largest number of out-of-school children. In fact, only yesterday, I saw the Minister of Education addressing the members of the House of Representatives on the need to give attention to out-of-school children in Nigeria that numbered up to about 20 million. Mr. President, this is the only country in the world where we have 20 million people out of school. Out of school. As a result, Mr. President, it has become imperative that if we have to develop through the aggregation of developmental efforts from the states and the zones, then Nigeria has a need to accommodate these zones as developmental centers. And that is what this uh, bi uh, bill seeks to achieve. And so, Mr. President, as the world continues to modernize, there is an imperative need for all of us to agree that we must establish centers of development. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.